Welcome back everyone, Crothos here again. We're gonna go ahead and get our UCE log out timer set up. So let's go ahead and import that. Import that in. All right, there, there we are. So let's go ahead and check out that wonderful README. Let's open over our screen again. So we'll move that over. All right, so not much to this one. It's pretty simple. Just gonna go ahead and drag this to our canvas. There you go. So now we have our logout pop up in here. You can always modify this to say or do things a little differently the way you want it to look. And that is literally the scope of what we need to do to get it integrated. It is now in here, and now if you want to modify logout timers uh, for AFK and so on like that, you can go in entities and in players here. And we can go on our warrior because that's what we've been testing with, and we're just going to find here in the player our uh, new addition that was put in for logout timers. And it's always a pain to find here because I can't always pick where it goes. It just shows up where it wants, so here's this. And we can go ahead and we have 30 seconds is the warning and 60 seconds is getting kicked. You can go all the way down to one. You can go as 9,999, you know, you pick. We're just gonna put ours currently at uh, 10 seconds for the warning just to make it quick and easy to see. Uh, let's do, let's do 15 sec, fix, uh, 10 seconds and 15 seconds, that's fine. All right, so the warning is gonna tell them they gotta move, otherwise it's gonna kick them out and the kick is going to actually kick them so the one difference you're going to see here is when we're doing the host so we're the server and the client it's going to just close our game because we can't kick us back to login because we're the server so it's going to just cancel everything out just to avoid having any weird errors uh, if you were just a client though it will just log you out back to the login screen because you don't have to worry about having problems because your servers trying to still run even though it's not able to so we're going to go and save that we'll collapse everything up here and we'll hit play and we'll test this out so we'll come in we'll click server and play and we'll start now we're just not going to do anything we're just going to chill here for the uh, 10 seconds and it should give us a pop-up telling us we got to move so there it is so we got to move so we'll move our character. Okay, it's like, all right, you're fine. You're still playing. We'll wait 10 more seconds for it to give us this pop-up again. And then we'll wait the five seconds for us to kick us out of the game. So there it is. Are you still there? Uh, we're not going to move. We're just going to let it kick us out. And voila, we got kicked because we were inactive uh, on the game. So this will help keep uh, a lot of AFK players out of your game. I would heavily suggest higher than 10, 15 seconds. Um Ideally, you probably want this, uh, in most games, uh, it's going to be like five minutes, uh, something like that. So you would just, I'm going to leave it at 30 and 60. Um, most games would do five minutes here and around 10 minutes or so here. So you give them some good leeway in case someone had to go to the bathroom or some of that nature. Uh, but that is the entire setup process for logout timer. So I'll catch you in the next one.